So, so. Everybody knows Mondo's got him. They're waiting for the big one with the jackhammer. He's here, right? Over with those. How are the ribs, Jack? Should be at home, healing. This is Sonia. We need to talk privately. What can I do for you, Jack? I've been thinking about this. I'm not going to do this fight next week. Fine. You owe me 11 grand plus interest. I'm working on it. Now. You know I don't have that kind of cash right now. I'll work it off. Yes, you will. In the ring next week with Mondo. Jack, two million dollars is a very big carrot. Don't make us show you this stick. Looks like Mondo has left the battle. Oh, 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 oh. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. It's all over. And here's the woman who makes it all possible. Sonia Star. Oh. And that wraps up our elimination tournament, Division B. And now I'd like to present a very special guest tonight. The winner from Division A, Jack the Jackass Mills! The grudge match of the century! Ah! Mondo versus the Jackass! One week from today, no mercy! I'd hate to see you die without a fight. Favourite police lieutenant has just cleared security. What are we telling her about the riddle of the mystery darts? That we have absolutely no idea who could have designed, built, or used such devices, and we are stymied and mystified. Well, that should certainly justify her faith in Hawkins' technologies. John, the police have created a task force to arrest the Mantis. If you have a better suggestion, let's hear it. Well, how about Lieutenant Maxwell? You look positively smashing. We'll tell her whatever she is likely to find out anyway, no more, no less. Well, just for the record, she does look absolutely smashing. Good luck, Lieutenant. Leora. Hi. Hi, yourself. Well, what's the verdict? Well, it looks like nerve deadener is introduced through a subcutaneous injection. Unfortunately, there's not enough of it here to tell what it is. But it seems a microbattery generates an electrical field somehow, in a way that is unclear, the two combine to disable its victim. Sounds like the high-tech version of those darts the South American Indians use. Only that drug is curare, a muscle relaxer. This causes nearly instantaneous muscle rigidity. I'm sorry we don't have more. Who could have made these? I can't tell you that. You know, I can't wait to meet this mantis. I've even drafted an arrest warrant for this psycho. DA should issue it by the end of the week. Hawkins? Hey, boss, what's happening in the world of the Mighty Mantis? Uh, nothing. This is not a good time. Oh, okay, hey, just two quick preguntas and I'm out. I'll just get rid of this. No, you keep talking. I want to get a good look at this dart anyway. I'm very busy. Okay, okay. Uh, number one, th these new phones. You you're telling me the calls bounce off your own personal satellite, which makes them so untraceable that I could call the White House and Hillary herself couldn't call me back. Unless, of course, I wanted her to, right? Yes, that is what I'm telling you. Love that. Okay, cool. Number dos. 
Did you see uh, my artwork that I left for you in the seed pod? Is it okay to go public with that? Artwork? Yeah, what do you think? About what? The artwork. You know, I really want to get it out there. I'd like to go, uh, you know, real wide with that. Is that okay? Are you sure you've told me everything about these darts? Absolutely. Great. I'm right on it. Smoking. Not now, I'm on a mission. Gots to go. Your husband has got to help us, too. Jack won't do that. Jack won't do what? Well, your wife's worried about you, Mr. Mills. Yeah, well, I think my wife should worry more about who she talks to. i got to ask you to leave. Take care of yourself. Terry, what are you doing talking to the cops? What did you say? Nothing. Because that's what you tell me, Jack. This is the way it has to be. This is for your own good. Oh, don't hand me that. If you're not going to tell me what's going on, then I'm going to find out by myself. Terry! The aura is obsessed with capturing the mantis. And irony of all ironies, the man she's chosen to help her do that is you. This just can't continue. Well, why not? Keep your enemies close to you. Oh, uh, Savage left this for you in the sea pod. I swear he thinks he's a spy. <laughs> what is it? Uh, some kind of artwork. I wanted to know if I thought he should let people see it. Miles, can you think of anything more harebrained than this? Yes. I think I told him to go put them up around town. all of them? A few of them got away. They were very popular items while they lasted. I got away with promotion. This is not one of your dance parties we're running here. Well, no offense, Doc, but if it was, we'd be hurting. You gotta admit, lately, uh, business has been kind of slow. But you were given a secure phone so you could contact us, not to start your own talk show. 
How are we supposed to find people in trouble if they can't find us? You do not call the shots. I do. That is the rule. You play by it or you can get out. Okay, okay. You're the boss. So what do we do? It's <clears throat> from a payphone. You can route it through here. Yeah. Hello? Are you the one that can help me? I'm not sure about that. Well, did you put out that flyer or not? Yes, ma'am, but... It's, it's my husband. He's involved in something, and I think it may be very dangerous. Now I think they're following me. Ma'am, I'm, I'm afraid we... Look, I'm not sure that uh, there's anything... You see, I don't know who else to turn to. I mean, he may be killed. The police can't help. Nobody can help. Be at Wu's Produce Market tomorrow at exactly 7 a.m. Someone will meet you there. And uh, buy one orange. And one grapefruit. You'll be contacted. Oranges. Grapefruits. <laughs> hey, <laughs> I'm taking a shot here. I think two ropes hanging down in the middle of the cage might be nice, and maybe we should raise the platforms. You sure you want all that stuff in here? It's show business. Our customers want their money's worth. Bartel, mm -hmm. how's the jackhammer holding up against the pre-fight jitters? A cop was at his place. That bastard called the police? No. It was his wife, I think. He came later. They had a big fight. This could really destroy Jack's concentration. Somebody watching him? Oh, it's wired. And Dolan's with her. She's the weak link. We have her, we have him. So let's go meet the little lady. I love oranges this time of year. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Consider yourself contacted. You? You're the guy. I mean, you don't look like what I expected. Uh, <laughs> I'm your point of entry, not your destination. Now, let's take a trip down the information aisle. Tell me about these people. They're threatening my husband. Who is? Well, these people that he works for at this high-class gambling place, I don't know exactly what he's doing for them, but I know that they're rich and that they're powerful. My two favorite things to go up against. Well, I I've heard things about this Mantis. The papers say that he kills people and that the police are after him. <laughs> well, they're wrong. He's the best thing that's ever happened in this city. Oh, yeah? Well, my husband used to be a boxer. He's very strong. So if these people can scare him, what makes you so sure that this thing can stop them? Look, take my word for it. No matter how tough these people are, my guy's tougher. Yeah, well, how tough are you? Me? Because you got one of them behind you. Really? Yeah. Okay, uh, just don't run, all right? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> Yeah, well, just keep talking. Okay. Just stay cool. Hey, don't look at him. Hey, wait! Listen, listen! If you stay cool, we might get out of this. In here! Get Sonja. You sure she came in here? Positive. You better be or it's your ass. You can make this easy or hard. Your choice. Flush them out carefully.
Wait a minute, what about Dolan? If we leave him, he can talk. Genuine article. Come on, let's get you to someplace safe. Miles, your pulse and respiration are well above normal. You've allowed that hyperactive post adolescence to talk you into endangering yourself again. This woman is vicious, John. Yes, but Savage and this girl saw her murder one of her own people in cold blood. Now, certainly, we could take that to the police. Unfortunately, neither Savage or the girl actually witnessed her doing it. They both had their heads down at the time. No. We've got to go to the club where the husband works and check it out. And for the record, it was the Mantis who decided to intervene, not Taylor Savage. The Mantis? Yes. The Mantis. Miles, you're referring to yourself in the third person. Doesn't that bother you? Why should it? Damn it, the Mantis isn't some kind of separate entity. It's you in that exoskeleton, Miles Hawkins. I think we should seriously consider... What, John? Stopping? Blissful ignorance? Business as usual? How about reality? You can't just mantisize every time something bad happens in this world. I love you like a brother. I can't stand by and watch you split off a part of yourself as if it were some kind of mystical outside force you can't control. I'm in total control. I'll tell you this much. I wish I'd had the mantis on my side when I was shot. You think I wanted to shoot Dolan? I didn't. But that thing left me no choice. You got a problem with that? You did what you had to with Dolan. I got no problem with that. But? If I were you, I'd get rid of that fancy gun you offed him with. Otherwise, the police could trace the bullet right back to you. They have to find me first. Homicide found this on a dead guy with a bullet hole through him. Nine millimeter. Well, that's strange. Conventional weaponry isn't his usual M.O. Officer in Lancer Division also found this. Thought you might want to take a look. This has got to be somebody's idea of a joke, right? Who knows? But even the people who write the jokes got to know what they're making fun of. I think it's time for you to call a manis. What took you guys so long? Who is this? Nah, that's not the way it works. You tell me first. I, uh, just saw your flyer. I think I need the Mantis to help me. Yeah, you need the Mantis, all right. You know, you cops ought to realize that the man's got a plan you should get behind. Cops? Oh, now you're gonna try and tell me you're not the cops. That your number's not, say, 555-5481? Am I speaking to the Mantis now? Next question. I'll keep it simple. Do you know the Mantis? I'll keep it simpler. Gots to go. What the hell was that all about? I don't know, but it didn't sound like a joke. Well, who are they, Jack? Her name is Sonia Storm. I doubt that's her real name. She owns the club. I'm fighting in these kinds of underground boxing matches. They... They call me the jackhammer. Jack, I thought you were done with boxing. I was. I started gambling at the club. Jack! Hey, at first it was doing good. And then, and then my luck turned. 
<laughs> when Sonia wanted me for these club fights, I just thought it'd be an easy way to pay her off. But she just kept sucking me in deeper and deeper. Well, then we should just get out of here. We should just run. Baby, this, this woman is so tied into the mob, we could run to Timbuktu and she'd track us down. What the hell are you doing? I'm going to call somebody who can help us. Hush. You think this thing is going to help us? Well, he saved me today. This woman is crazy. She's got millions of dollars riding on this last match. Millions of dollars? Jack, what kind of fight are we talking about here? I, I told you, it's, just, it's, like, it's like street fighting. It's just no holds barred kind of stuff. Damn it, Jack, you're lying. Nobody pays millions of dollars for a street fight. You tell me the truth or I'm gone. I mean it. I'm gone for good and you'll never see either one of us again. Either of you? Yeah, that's right, either one of us. Jack, I don't want to say goodbye. I don't. But I will. It's like this. Two guys who went to the ring. And only one comes out alive. <laughs> Membership card. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Can you believe it? Check out the guy in the wheelchair. Good evening, gentlemen. I'm Sonny Storm. Oh, my, yes, you are. I am Desmond Decker, and this is my friend Herbert Davidson. Nice to meet you, gentlemen. Give me your wallets. A big pardon, ma'am. Your wallets. Give them to me. Well, I thought we'd be allowed a few games of chance before being uh, relieved of our possessions. Desmond Decker, up here from Kingston, huh? And Mr. Dills. Okay, gentlemen, welcome to 99. Oh. What's your game? All right, darling. 21 red. <laughs> oh! They're hot tonight, you see? <laughs> very, very impressive, Mr. Decker. Yeah, it might be a little bit more impressive if we had something more stimulating to bet against. Really? Like what? Mm -hmm. Something sporting, you see? <laughs> Where are you gentlemen staying? Oh. <laughs> the Large Mont Hotel. Then we'll be in touch. Sonia, come here. I gotta talk to you. Back for another try at the crap tables, Jack? I'm just gonna tell you this once. You and your boys better stay away from my wife. And I'm just gonna say this once. You play by my rules. That way I'm happy and your wife gets to live. Otherwise, I'm unhappy and your wife, well... Okay. Your rules. I do not have to go through with this. Who's there? that thing that phantom i am the mantis i can help you i don't need anybody's help i know what i have to do and what i have to do i have to do alone you'll kill a man or you'll be killed either way you're breaking the law and you lose just go away leave me alone why jack so you can build up the hate the hate it takes to hurt a man the hate it takes to kill what do you know about it i know about the darkness in a man's soul. Violence doesn't make it go away, Jack. I don't have a choice. 
There is another way. There is no other way. There's only one way. And it's not mine. And it's not yours. It's just the way it is. Give me that. Hey, Stonehead, didn't your mother ever teach you not to grab? And didn't your mother teach you never to be excessively annoying? <laughs> Taylor, would you please stop playing with that machine? Sorry. Incoming. Oh, good. She's taking our bait. You're on. Larchmont Hotel. Room 328, please. Dills here. Mr. Dills, it's Sonia Storm. Oh, yes, I was uh, hoping you'd call. You and your friend expressed an interest in sports. Does that include boxing, or is that perhaps too violent for you? Oh, no, not at all. In fact, violence is its um, premier attraction. I know a sport that makes boxing look like ballroom dancing. Would that intrigue you and your friend? Quite. How might we uh, participate? You buy a ticket for $100,000. Well, that's a bit uh, steep, isn't it? I've taken the liberty of checking your financial records. Not too steep for you. Oh, yes. Oh, we only accept cash. Um, is there some sort of uh, money-back guarantee if I'm disappointed in the performance? You won't be. Goodbye, Mr. Dills. We'll contact you. She's hooked. Good. They want a fight. We'll give them a fight. <laughs> you missed a spot. Come here. That's much better. I love you. And I love you, too. If you really do, then don't fight tonight. How did you know? I didn't until right now. <laughs> I gotta do it. I don't have a choice. Jack, please! Your husband's right, Mrs. Mills. He doesn't have a choice. What are you doing? We had a deal! I'm just making sure you keep to it. Jack! Move it, sister. Please stop doing that. I just like to look at it, you know? Come on, I've never seen this much cashola before. Yeah, well, don't get too attached to it. Here you are. Oh, great. So you get the dinner and I get the crumbs. What's the deal with that thing? A two-way RF tracking device with a microprocessor chip. You'll know where we are at all times. Miles? I've activated the remote transmitter. Are you reading us? Westbound on Adams Parkway, just north of the Greenfield exit. Right, oh, yeah. See you at the dance. Mr. Dills, what happened to your Jamaican friend? 
That ungrateful sod is no friend of mine. He took off for parts unknown, owing me £50,000. He won in a friendly poker game. <laughs> so who is this? This. This is someone much more reliable. That's who. I'm sorry, but this event is by special invitation only, and you don't have one. Oh, I don't have one. Listen, do you know where this uh, little Ben Franklin came from? Do I care? Monte Carlo. I had just lost $50,000. I was blessed, but this friend of mine, Eddie Vedder, gave me this. I put it on 34 black to ride. And you're looking at the result. <laughs> you know Eddie Vedder? No. Him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I produced Pearl Jam's last U.S. tour. I got the stones going out right now. I just came from uh, training with Mick to get him back in shape. But hey, whatever. If rock and roll money's not good enough for you... Yeah, then neither is mine. Dills? Of Do you think I have time for this? Come on, we're out of here. Gentlemen, don't be so hasty. I'm sure your money's fine. You can't be too careful these days. We wouldn't want anyone but the paying customers monitoring our event. Oh. They're clean. Empty your pockets, too. Everything. Come on. I said everything. Uh, oh, um, uh, I'd like to hang on to this. You know, this was given me by my dear old mother, and uh, I promised her I'd never, ever, ever part with it. You'll get it back at the end of the evening. Have a wonderful time, gentlemen. You heard the lady. Functioning. The tracking device is functional. Is the tracking device moving? Negative. The tracking device is stationary. Ladies and gentlemen, our main event, Mondo and the Jackhammer fight to the Well, if he's following your tracking devices at the roulette table at the 99 Club. Pretty good, Jackie boy. But the breeze on that. Jack is having a living daylight speed now. Got to do something. Oh, look, here's my plan. I'll create some kind of diversion and you get to a phone. Oh, then call who? Well, call the bloody yes. police for all I care. The police? What if the mantis still gets here? What if he doesn't? Okay, there goes. This is a fix! You won't be hurt! Don't you realize? Nothing here! Nothing here is real! You've been taken for a fight! You said oh. They've taken you for fools! From England! Get your watch you for! Nine one one. Yeah, I have a police emergency. I don't know the address, but I think just say you're in hell. I just knew that idiot was gonna tank it. 
Oh, I just lost a hundred thousand reasons for living. Why am I so stupid? Come on, get up. Yeah, hi, I just called. Uh, if any of you cops want to find the real scum that killed that guy with that strange dart found in him, they're all here with me. I'm down by the docks somewhere near the, the train yard, maybe in that, uh, that old hydro plant that closed down about 10 years ago. Open police scanning frequencies. Unit 37, dispatch. Maxwell here. Lieutenant, a male voice called in with an emergency. Said something about some perps. Killed the guy. Yeah, so? Well, he said something about darts and. Darts, what about them? Well, according to this call, the suspect who killed the victim with the strange dart found in him might be down the abandoned hydro plant by the train yard. Great, we got a live one. Should get out. Hey, forget it. We're not leaving you. Of course we're not. I can just get you up. Display back by reaching the connector. There you go. Yeah! <laughs> 
police. Okay, folks, I want everybody against this wall. Everybody to my right now. Everybody until we sort this thing out. Hello. You're not the same person I talked to before. Who are you? You know me. You're the Mantis. It's illegal to record this conversation. The police should know better. We need to talk. Will you meet me somewhere? Why? So you can bring more police, so you can arrest me. Look. I don't know much about you. I only know that you're taking the law into your own hands, and I know that is wrong. Isn't it wrong for people to be afraid to go out? For criminals to fear no one? The streets aren't safe. Corruption is everywhere. Murder has become blood sport. You can't stop it. Is it wrong for someone else to try? Yes, no one gave you the right to do this. No one appointed you. I have appointed myself. Then you know better than the criminals you say you want to stop. Now know this. All criminals will live to fear the Mantis. What do you mean by that? The Mantis will do exactly what is necessary. God. 